<laughs> have I seen the new Ender Slayer? What do you mean, the new update? Like, I've seen... There's this gravity one thing that pulls everything together. And there's some other weird stuff that they're adding to... I don't know. They're doing some things that I'm not too interested about. We'll see, though. If they, if they add an Enderman Slayer, that's going to be very interesting. We'll see how that goes. It'll be cool for two days and then they'll it'll be boring again and we'll just go back to like dungeons or something. Wait, Gab, do you have pets? And if so, if so, pet names and type. I do actually have a pet. It's not mine. Um, it's my sister's, technically. So basically the story with my pet is my sister has wanted a, a dog for the longest time or wanted a dog for the longest time. But dogs are very high maintenance and require a lot of effort to maintain. So that was out of the question. There was no way we were going to get um, a dog. But we ended up getting a cat, which is because cats are low maintenance and they're not as hard to take care of, I guess. So I have a cat. His name's Bailey. He actually, I guess the anniversary of this cat living in our house was actually yesterday, I think. It's been like a, it's been a year now since we've had this pet in the house. But just for the record, I don't feed it. I don't take care of it. I don't do anything at all with it. It's not allowed in my room. Like, it has nothing to do with me. So, if it were for me, I wouldn't have an animal in the house, but my sister wanted one, and my sister and my mom take care of the cat, so... It's on them, really. You have a bird named John Wick. Don't ask, why have you got a bird named John Wick? That is weird, dude. That's weird, what, did the, did the bird kill things with a pencil? Yes, definitely. Is cereal soup, bro? Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. So you're saying because soup is a liquid, with usually with bits in it, like you can have a pumpkin soup, which is just the pumpkin soup. I don't, I don't think you could classify cereal as soup because you drown out the cereal with the milk, or you don't want to drown it. Depends on how much milk you put in. Um, or if you're a psychopath, water. <laughs> My beers are very good. Thank you, man. Do you like the guides or the highlights or both? Also, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I just ditched doing shorts videos. Can't be bothered anymore. Then again, I've just not, yeah, I've just been lazy. I don't pick out clips anymore. I think I, I might just keep them at the end of videos instead of putting them as whole separate videos, because there's no point. Mostly the highlights, fair enough. I feel like a lot less people like the highlights. I've done a couple of polls before and people much prefer the the guide style videos. You kind of concerned about tier 5 Taras, you think they might put in the mechanic Arachne has with the webs? Yeah, you're right, and that'll be very annoying <laughs> if they do that. Arachne's webs are stupid annoying? Agreed. But people just one tap them anyways, or use Hyperions and stuff and insta-kill them, so like, is it really gonna be that much of an issue? <laughs> Who knows bro, we'll see. For the 31st minion slot to be available, there would need to be two more minions, and every minion in the game would have to have a tier 12. Mad. You think that's gonna happen? Or they're gonna do that anytime soon? Either way, one of my goals, I feel like before I end up ev ev eventually quitting this game, is gonna be to max out every minion. I will have a tier 11 and tier, a tier 12 Tara and Rev minion. Because there will be a tier 12 Tara, there's no way they don't add that. And obviously tier 12 is on everything else that I can. I'm not gonna have like unfinished minion upgrades. Even if it's useless, I'm not gonna have unfinished upgrades. 30 of every minion max. 30? No. Okay, that's way too- that's ridiculous. 30 of every minion max would be like 50 bill. Maybe not that much, but like, definitely way too much. It'll happen eventually, I'm sure. It could be soon if Dwarven Mines brings a new mining minion and Enderman Slayer brings a new Slayer minion. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if Dwarven Mines will bring another mining minion. Like a Titanium minion. Would they do that? Really? I don't know. If they did, I mean, there's your two minions. The Enderman one and then the- Oh, no. We could get a Wolf Slayer minion. We could get a Wolf Slayer and a um, Enderman Slayer minion. And that would be the two new minions. And then if they just added tier 12s for everything, then we'd have 32 minion slots. That could be cool. Alright, let's kill this Sven follower. Come back. You're bald. Hairless, hairless wolf. Furless wolf. Do wolves have fur? Do wolves have fur? Or do wolves have hair? They have fur, right? I'm I'm not I'm not super dumb, right? Pretty sure wolves have fur. I'm I'm hoping that I'm not tripping. Oh, this is about to be the dairy combo all over again. Why do you always link in my bloody old conversations, dude? What do you mean? Wolves have fur, right? Wolves have fur. 
I'm gonna say wolves have fur. They do not have hair. You can't get a hairless wolf. You can get you can get hairless wombats though. Hairless wombats. <laughs> nah, furless, furless wolf. A bald wolf. <laughs> sandwich maker minion. Why sandwiches? What would the sandwiches be made out of? What are they for? Are they a minion fuel? A minion that makes fuel. Could you imagine? Like a hyper catalyst minion or something? And it powers itself with its own resources to make it more resources. Could be interesting. How does weight work? Like, the weight calculations in guilds and stuff? Has that got to do with, like, how good your slayer is, how good your cata is, like, all that? Is that what weight means? See, like, I'm not- I'm not sweaty. I don't- I don't grind this game. I'm just a casual, bro. I would have no idea. I'm not even in a guild. Guilds are for noobs. Skills, cata, slayer. I see, I see. Weight is basically how the Skyblock community determines where you are in the game, I see. So it's just sweaty people talk that I couldn't care less about. That is a problematic name. Gab is hotter than you, bro. Thank you for the follow, bro. Appreciate it. Do you have any you? Nah, bro. I've never had any in my life. You know? Yo, I got a spirit rune? Mad. Look, I've never had any in my entire life. Wait, you can- Oh my god, I can enchant my bat phone. Oh my god, wait a minute. Wait a minute, I can enchant my bat phone. Yo, I can enchant the bat phone. <laughs> this looks so ugly. <laughs> this looks so ugly. Imagine putting an orange, orange glint on a bat phone. Oh my god, that's so gross. Nah, 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 I'm gonna make it pink. Nah, green. White. Yes, black. Black enchant glint. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Cool. This is what my this is what my bat phone looks like now. It's just a, it's just a black square in my inventory. It's a black cube. Guys, you like my bat phone? It looks great, doesn't it? I'm holding a, a black s square cube, not square. Square is two dimensional. I want to turn off the combo, the kill combos in chat. Is there a way to do that? Is there a way to turn off the kill combo messages? Like, is there a mod that does it that I, that I can get? <laughs> DSM. DSM does. Actual? I don't think I have the new DSMs, you know. I should probably install them. Let me see. Um, uh, Grand... Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, I don't know what it would be called. The Grandma Wolf thing. We'll see. I'd probably have to install the new one. Nah, I'll just install Hail. I'll install Hail, inject into DSM. It'll be so poggers, guys. Because I'm a cheater. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, Hail is injected into DSM. Because if it wasn't, it would be a lot easier for Hypixel to just blacklist the mod. But because it's injected into DSM and there's no other forms of hail, they can't just blacklist the mod because it'll blacklist DSM. Which is a legit mod that a lot of people use. It's pretty crazy, right? <laughs> don't ask how I know that. Um, I don't have it. I don't have it. You know, I'm not a cheater, I promise. I'm totally legit, guys. <laughs> can't F I G. Yeah, for good reason. For good reason. Maybe I should get rid of my username command because people just expect that I take friend requests. People expect that I do party invites and friend requests. Like, bro, what are you smoking? You like my friends list, guys? Like my friends list? It has seven people on it. If you're not one of these cool people, you're not on my friends list, all right? It's that simple. I only friend cool people and you're not cool enough to be on my friends list. It's a friends list? Exactly. It's not a everyone in my Twitch chat list. It's not an everyone in my Twitch chat list, guys. I'm gonna friend all my viewers. Not a random dude list. Exactly! Someone has brain cells! Someone has brain cells! No way! I've never heard anyone think the same way that I do, bro. Everyone just has, like, 50-page friend lists with, like, a bunch of random people they meet. Oh my god, dude. I'm not insane. I'm glad to know that I'm not the only non-insane person that exists. I don't want to do slash FL to see, like, 20 pages of people online. Like, that's not what I'm trying to do, bro. I add people who I think are cool, dude. I add people who are, like, my mates or people that I would, like, actually play with. People that I want to be around. I'm going to die. No, I'm not. I'm safe. We survived. But, yeah, that, that's what the point of a friends list is, dude. So, for everyone who has always wondered, oh, why can't I friend you? That's why. I don't do friends list, friends requests, bro. It's not my thing. Like, I'm not trying to sound, like, super rude or anything or, like, condescending, but, like, what do you guys gain from having me friended? Like, what do you- what ben how does it benefit you? How does it benefit you? Like, at what point does having me on your friends list actually matter? What would it do? Because the reason that I have Amphrized, um, Vent, Junk, Pyro, Devil's D, 
Who are my other friends? Kuda? I think Kuda's on my friends list. A bunch of people. The reason why I have those like six or seven people in my friends is, is so that I can ask them to play if they're online. Or so I can ask them for help or something if I ever need it for some weird reason. It's a flex? How is a flex? How is that a flex? How is having a 16 year old weird kid who lives in Australia a flex? Please explain. Please explain. What is the difference between me and literally anybody else that plays this game? Like, I don't even have a flashy name. I don't have anything cool. Like, I'm, I'm just someone else, bro. I'm just somebody else. Also, I've also never understood why flexes are valuable in any way. When people care about whether you have cool items in a game or people caring about whether you have, you know, a red name on your friends list. Like, why, why does that matter? Why is a flex important? Like, the way that I've seen everything is I will work on me and my gameplay and how I want to play the game. I don't care what you do. I don't care how good you are. I don't care if you're better than me. I don't care if you're the number one player in the world, right? Because it doesn't affect me, right? I'll focus on what affects me and my playing and me playing the game, not other people. Other people are a waste of my time, right? So I've never understood what, what what's the point of flexing. Like, you want to be a number one in the collection for me, not to show off. Exactly, like, you do it because you want to see how far you can go. Whether you could achieve number one in the collection, right? As a way to test against yourself. You're competing against yourself. Can I beat my, my number 10 spot to get to number 9? Can I beat my number 9 spot to get to number 8, right? I don't know, man. I just, I don't understand. It's, it, like, I, I wouldn't go for number one in the collection to go, look at me, guys. I'm number one in Mithril. <laughs> like, that. <laughs> so what? I don't care. I don't care, bro. Oh my god. I mean, it's a cool achievement. Like, it's fair to share that stuff with people, but, like, I don't understand the whole... Oh, it's a cool flex. Like, I don't give a shit, but sure. Gab number one in Mithril confirmed? I am. I am. It's true. Here's who I have to be. Exactly. Exactly. You gotta compete with me, Apollo. I'm actually the guy who's number one. This is not okay. This is not okay. This is not okay. What? What have you done? What have you done? What have you done? Why did you give me a levitation? <laughs> Why am I a Y1000? I'm a Y1000. Help. <laughs> milk. I need milk. I need milk. <laughs> I'm a Y2000. Like, <laughs> Just hit the MLG. I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Time to hit the MLG. Time to hit the MLG, boys. Come on. No, not the water. I need to hit the MLG. Gotta hit the MLG. <laughs> Yo, I'm insane! I'm insane! I'm insane! I'm insane! <laughs>